This class at Buffalo High School is called Inclusive Physical Education. This has been life changing for both students and me and this school and it's changing the atmosphere of our whole school. It brings kids with special needs together with the rest of their peers to do everything from playing volleyball to lifting weights. I've never had friendship like this before until, until, the high, until high school. It's the second year of the class and started after it was becoming more and more apparent that kids with special needs were not venturing outside of their special ed hallway. We're kind of increasing their um, communicating and ability to say hi in the hallway and who can I sit with in the cafeteria. Um, this class has really made it safe for them to expand beyond their little hallway. And expanding all the way to the nation's capital too. Jen Hebink and two students were invited to Washington DC recently by Special Olympics to talk about the importance of unified PE. We were able to speak to senators and House of Representatives and, and lawmakers about why unified PE needs to be continually funded. Jen says she hopes someday they can expand this concept into things like unified art and cooking classes. More opportunities for connections to be formed. Deep special friendships and we want them to be able to connect, belong and be brave. I talk about being brave daily in this class. Being brave and expanding minds in the process. It changes your whole perspective on the way you view people that you just don't know. Brian Pyatt, Carol Eleven News. I think that's a great program. I mean, the inclusiveness of it. Right. I mean, I think it also normalizes, hey, people with special needs, they want to be a part of anything just like we all do. Yeah, and yeah. to have it, you know, perhaps expanding to other classes in the future, just mm -hmm. a great thing.